Hey, welcome back to another early stream. Uh, I'm liking the time here, except that it's fucking hot. It's, I, I like doing it an hour earlier that hasn't cooled down as much as, as it would an hour from now. So it, it's a really fucking hot start, but I'm enjoy, I'm, I'm, I like the little bit earlier uh, start. Let me get Kenshi up here. Uh, something to keep in mind, something to note. I actually installed a couple of mods. Because I was fucking around with it, I was testing it out, I wanted to see how it worked. I just got a little bit of, just a couple of tiny mods, you know, just a, just some little stuff. Let's pet some visuals there while I'm telling you this. Uh, just, just some minor stuff that I thought would be fun, I wanted to try out. And, uh, it hasn't broken the save or anything. I tested it out, I tested it on a new save, I tested it on the old save, it seems fine. I got, uh, some mod that, I'm just looking at the list here, when you, like, start up the game. I got something that improves the shopping economy. I guess it gives, like, characters just running around town more money so that you can start up your own store in, like, your outpost or something. And, uh, it won't just be... They'll actually be able to buy from it instead of just having no money. I have Recruit Prisoners on. Quite a few people have told me about that one. Apparently we should now be able to kidnap people and then force them into slavery, force them to work with us, work for us. Uh, we got Reactive World, which adds some neat shit. I don't really know exactly what it does, but apparently certain factions you can, like, kill and stuff. And this just adds some bonus things that happen when you, uh, when you do that. Then I added a map, which is fucking sweet. I'm very happy about the map. I added this little thing that lets, uh, characters that say unique lines, they'll repeat them. It's just a minor thing. Uh, I upped the squad limit, and I added a thing that makes it so the hair doesn't get clip clipped off in the armors. That's it. Mostly minor stuff. I mean, like, stuff like that hair one. It's like the most minor shit you could possibly, you know, could possibly download. But a couple of them are a little bigger. A couple of them will actually have, I think, more of an impact. Con especially, like, recruit prisoners. And the map. The map doesn't give away locations, but it does show, like, roads and shit like that, and it's nice. It shows, like, zones. Um, hello. Can you pick up the game? Do I have to do window capture? I do. But not that window. This window. Okay. Yeah, welcome back. You can see in my loads here, I did a couple of tests to make sure it worked. So ignore those. This is the last one we were on. Slaves of Squabblin Jr. Uh, let me turn on the song request. I don't know if much has been added to it, but a couple of things have. And there's a couple from last time, too. Just get that playing. Oh, and let me turn off the music in this. I think I turned it back on for the test. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> EU3 music. Good. Alright. Let's get it started up. It fucking takes forever anyway. I don't know if you guys heard the, uh, the recent news. I, I joke about this. Someone already made the joke on Discord, but... I've joked about this before that my roommate, Dalton, he copies everything I do. Uh, I drop out of college, year later, he drops out of college. You know, j just like, like, every little thing. I become religious, a few months later, he starts going to church. You know, like, like, stuff like, like that. It's pretty common. I go to Alaska and become a commercial fisherman, year after that, he goes to Alaska and becomes a commercial fisherman. I think he's taken it a step too far. Because, uh, about three months ago, I was in a car accident, it fucked up my back, it actually sucks dick. My back, especially lately, has been, like, terrible. Uh, and just today, he got rear-ended. <laughs> and maybe also fucked up his back, which I think is a little too much dedication to the joke. Like, haha, yeah, you, you copy everything I do, you didn't need to, like, go out and, your, and cripple yourself. But he did. What are you gonna do? It's the- it's the highest form of flattery. Imitation. Uh, but welcome back. I'm just getting the volume on here, right? As this loads in. I don't remember exactly what was happening last time, but I think we were getting the shit beaten out of us. Something like that. Who is this? Right, yeah, I think these skeleton bandits were trying to beat the shit out of us. I don't know why we're just, like, standing next to them. Uh, but you can see here, look at this nice fucking map. I mean, all these locations we know about just because we've been there or we bought maps, so those aren't added because of the- because of the mod. But the mod adds these nice little zones, so you know where you fucking are, and then these red lines are the, are the roads. Roads, you know, in quotation marks, because they're really just like paths. Dirt paths. 
But like, now I know. You start out in the border zone. That's what that fucking place is called. And uh, here's, you know, here's the Great Desert, for ex for instance, where we are operating right in the center of it. And there are the roads. I didn't even know there were roads. It's kind of nice. I can, I can see... For instance, that we passed right through this zone of no roads at all, and maybe that's why it took so fucking long to go through some of these places. And now I know that, like, hey, maybe follow some roads for part of that. Also, Sniper Valley. Also, you know, some of the names might give me an idea. I was right in thinking that this was probably the Ashlands, but, like, a lot of this might give me an idea of what's here. For instance, I saw this when I was testing it out. Cannibal Plains. Oh, well, <laughs> you know, well, I think I know what's there. I don't know what Leviathan Coast is. It's it's just nice. I like it. Obedience, I think, is the... Uh, no, that's Rebirth. It's the slave place. I don't know what Obedience is. Fog Islands, I'm not sure about either. Although I know somebody told me that this was somewhere I should go because there might be someone I can recruit there for free. But it also looks fucking dangerous. So we'll, we'll see about that. Uh, anyway, I believe our plan was to get to the Lost... No, we actually went to the Lost Armory. Right, our plan now was to maybe go down somewhere else? We went here already, right? Yeah, that's where we saw those those spiders, those uh, mechanical spider things. We stole some shit. I think we were in between plans. So my basic plan at the moment is I'm looking at my guys and I'm, I'm thinking like, hey, we're not good enough. I mean, Squabblin Jr., 20 in katanas, that's something. But most of them are even worse than that. Hobbs has shit. Uh, Ruka is probably the best, but she also only has 20 in her max skill. And like someone like Squerve, the gen you know the, the somewhat new guy, has no combat skills at all. I think he was using crossbows though. Yeah, but still, he's got like no crossbow skills. So my my plan now is I've realized sort of the utility in picking fights with random nobodies. So I'm probably gonna head back into this area. Maybe even back to where it all started. Back to where it all began. Back to the border zone, back to the hub. To find some, or, or back to the desert. Some place where I know there's gonna be some vagrants and shit. Probably border zone though, because I want to pass through some of these places. Maybe check out the swamp. And uh, just beat the shit out of some people. And if they beat me up, oh well. Maybe I'll have like Hobbs hide in a corner while everyone gets into a fight. And uh, we just beat the shit out of them. Or we get the shit beaten out of us, but either way, we're training. Either way, we're getting better, right? I made a stream on time. I'm happy. I have school tomorrow. Screw it. Full stream. <laughs> yeah, uh, I appreciate the dedication. School's for losers anyway. Dr drop out. I thought these skeleton bandits were killing me, but I seem to be just hanging out next to them with my knocked out buddies. Recovery, coma, crippled, normal, normal. Okay. Yeah, I think we're just gonna head... Now that we know where these roads are, it's pretty nice. Was there another ruin we want to check out? I don't think there was. I think it was just, we checked out that one, and now we want to get the fuck out of here. So, let's head to this town. It's the closest, and I want to get back to... I'm pretty sure this whole area down here is not safe. That's just a... I mean, nowhere in this game is fucking safe. It's, it's all one continuous hell. But... I mean, I think this is, like, marginally safer. So I'm gonna- I'm gonna head here. Maybe fuck around with the Shek. Maybe if we're strong enough, we invade the Shek and just kill him. <laughs> just murder all of them. But for now, yeah, let's start heading that way. Okay, they're ignoring me. That's great. We're walking right by. That's perfect. We'll have to keep an eye on this because I'm afraid, but... Also, what we want to do is check out our- our amazing outpost. Uh, what's going on here? Hugh is knocked out. No, he's just sleeping. Oh, he's fine. Hugh, get the fuck up. Uh, let me turn up this music. Genocide is always fun. I agree. That's what I'm thinking, is maybe just some genocide is in order. Why you, you're hiding while mining? That's fine. <laughs> I'm okay with that, I guess. Do we have anyone on the turrets? We don't. What is Squuckle doing? Hiding. His leg is gone. Right, I forgot about that. Squint. Oh, right. Squints and hang. Oh, yeah. I sent Squint here so I could buy, uh, protection. So I could pay the traitor mafia to stop attacking me. Uh, this is their base, isn't it? Yeah, this is the HQ. Um, can I 
and talk to one of you? Because that would actually be great. I would love to stop being attacked by fucking these city hero fucks. Yamdu. Yeah, go talk to Yamdu. See if he can hit, hook me up with protection. Uh, but anyway, Sten. Sten's starving. Squulk. Squulk is starving. Everyone is starving to death. Booblin, I probably sent to go get food. Yes. Where are you? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I thought she was just in the middle of the fucking desert. No, there's town. I mean, we are in the middle of the fucking desert, but nah, she's going to Shobutai. Cool. So Squuckled lost his leg. He's going to be worthless, probably. We'll have to figure out something for that old fuck to do. Squint's on a mission. Booblin's getting food. Hugh is standing around. Go do your job. There you go. Sweet. It's cool that you still got Squantsville, though. That's a good name for it. <laughs> no, it's, yeah, it's a nice little place. Why are you walking so fucking slow? I've got you on run mode, don't I? That's just the speed you decide to go at? <laughs> All right. Take your fucking time. See if I care. Uh, let's go back to the squad and make sure that we're not going to die in, while traversing this very dangerous area. Also, I've been told somewhat of the value of exploring, of not just going on straight lines to places I need to get to. Actually, occasionally look... Ooh, super high quality copper out here. Maybe worth knowing in the crags. But sometimes, apparently, it is not... It is worth not just, you know, taking the quickest path and getting right to where you need to go. Sometimes it's worth looking around and seeing if you can find some shit. Apparently there's, like, dungeons and shit like that. Uh, where you can find good stuff. Here's some more copper. Here's some people. What kind of... Oh, crab people. Yeah, see, this area, like I said, is not... not safe. I don't want to deal with crab people. Just... Just sneak. Just sneak away. It's getting dark. Is there somebody else down here? The fuck is that? A land bat. All right. Yeah. Avoid that too, if you would. I'd rather. Yeah. Land land bat. Just ignore that. Just uh, we're in a bad zone. It's raining ash. I have no comment on raining ash. There's no there's no Jew joke there. There's no uh, just like just like the Gorillion. That's one of their death camps right there. I made the joke anyway. I don't know. I, didn't, I couldn't even stop myself. You gonna pass through this UFO? I'm surprised it actually lets you do that. Huh. Uh, yeah, this zone looks terrible. This, this zone looks like fucking instant death. But there's a road nearby. What is this? What the fuck is that? Discovered outpost. That's an outpost? Or is that an outpost? Maybe I'll check that out. But there seems to be a lot of shit walking around. More land bats. Yeah, I mean, I guess go check out the outpost. It might be another one of those situations like that armor guy who we stole all of his best armor from and we're still rocking that shit. We need to sell all these power cores, though. We're gonna be fucking filthy rich. I forgot about that. We, we are going to be loaded. And we've already got $24,000. Money is, like, not a concern anymore. That's a lot of land bats. Okay. Just sort of skirt that. Ash Wednesday was yesterday, if that explains the ash. I suppose that explains the ash. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think Ash Wednesday is, like, cremation day, though. I think you got that wrong. No, you're right. This the entire earth got a cross on their on their forehead made of ash. And this is just where they did it. This is the forehead right here. And just like that. Stobes Gamble, this is called by the way. I don't know what I'm supposed to glean from that information. Don't split up. Don't split up. Don't split up. Don't split up. You're gonna fucking die, squabbling. I'm gonna wait for them to pass. I don't trust this. Is everybody good on food? Aren't we like out of food? <laughs> yeah, right. So we have this is like a classic moral uh, Like like some story you'd heard here in a children's book where we were got so greedy that we we went after all of our money at the expense of food and we starved to death while loaded with dosh It's it's there's a moral here if you're if you can 
If you can take it to heart, you might learn something. Maybe we should have invested more on food. What the fuck is this? Black Gorilla. Oh. Yeah, we, we might be in, like, the, one of the most dangerous... Yeah, look at those... that health and those stats. I think we might be in one of the most dangerous areas in the fucking game. I think we... I think we need to hurry. It's a good thing our stealth is fucking amazing. Because otherwise, this zone would be instant death, I think. Luckily, we're kind of fast, too, so we might be able to outrun anything. Oh, and they're fighting. Oh, nice. Whichever one dies, we might be able to pick up some loot after they pass on. Maybe get some gorilla skins. Probably worth a ton. There's another gorilla. Is this just like... Yeah, this doesn't look good. What is this? Old Empire Supply Outpost. That sounds fucking very good. Okay. Hopefully there's no, like, killer robots in here. You know, just... <laughs> just... Just in case... Hopefully, we'll be fine. I think we'll be fine. Uh, Hobbs is still the best at this, right? Yeah, f fucking 47. Hobbs is a master. Pick the lock. Whoa, is this a remix of... No oh, yeah! Nice duvet remix. How, how did you find a Serial Experiments Lane remix that I haven't heard before? I like it. Like synth wave. I'm gonna turn up a little bit, because there's that faint synth in the background, which is actually the melody. This is sweet, though. Alright, cross your fingers, no, no baddies. Nice! Is that a- wait, is that a security spider? Oh. What do we- do we even have- Can we even pick shit up? Aren't we, like, full? Ah, uh, Hobbs. Oh, no, wait. Hobbs? Yeah, we're mostly full, but, uh, here's what we'll do. Wait, Carp is alright? I thought Carp was in a coma. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, there he is. Let's trade with Carp. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna give him some of this stuff so that we have room to, uh, to loot. In fact, Ruka... Is Ruka being carried? No. Um, Ruka also trade with Carp. Give him a bit of stuff. Yeah. Just clearing up a little bit of space. Oh, same thing with Squirve. Yeah, put down Squirve. And trade with... Oh, Squirve's fine now. Okay, good. Uh, we'll give him some stuff to clear space as well. Oh, he's got a huge backpack. Why the fuck were we not using that? Wait. Out of trading range. Okay. We're gonna send in one guy at a time because I don't feel I don't feel comfortable about this. Get over here. Carp is on the ground, that's fine. Uh Hobbs, get in there. Ooh, he is so fucking fast. Okay. Is he like asleep or something? Seems to be just one robot guarding this entire fucking cache. So uh check out the food store first. Ancient Nutra Rations, worth 500 bucks, and very filling. Okay, well that's nice. Alright. What's in here? Metal chest. 90%. Yeah, fucking get in. On a character, click next to the X on the top and you can see stuff. What, this? What do you mean? Doesn't that just, doesn't that just lock it into place? That just locks it, doesn't it? Which is useful. But, okay. Skeleton repair kits, which are very valuable. Um, steel, fabric, copper, not really feeling it. Metacrate sounds really good. Advanced medicine. Ooh, okay. Who has a lot of space available? Yeah, wait, do you have the, no, who has the backpack that stacks? He does. Okay, drop that shit. And, you know what? Trade with him. No? Trade with him. Oh, he's gotta crawl over there because he's crippled right now. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Ooh, it's getting sunlight though. Hurry up, please. I know speeding up the time doesn't make it ha happen faster, but... 
switch these. No, well, wait. No, I don't want him crawling over. So no, that doesn't make sense. Crawl back. Ruka, or Squamblin Jr., crawl over here. Trade with him. We need to be faster. Uh, trade backpacks. Very nice. Now, he's got this one with lots of space in it. How much is this worth? 2,000. Holy shit. Uh... Uh, oh, okay. So now I'm gonna have Squabblin come in and pick up all that medical stuff because it should stack in his backpack. Yeah. All right. Nice. Sweet. And there's another. Nice. Nice. We are never going to be injured ever again. Okay. Now you can get out. Hops can continue. Go check out this. Is it empty? No. Metal, don't need it. We got the food already. Building materials, I don't fucking need that. Med more medical stuff. It's not worth that much. We've already got a lot of it, so let's continue. Um, food, take another look. Those do seem very good. We'll stack those in somebody else's backpack, too. General storage. This is a fucking gold mine, by the way. Electrical components. Check this. No. Armor storage. General chest. Come on, where's the weapons? Where's the fucking ancient technology? Where's the shit that you couldn't find anywhere else? Where's the stuff that's worth risking my life for? Ah, it's fucking metal. Give me, give me more, give me something. This one's got a really hard lock on it. Okay, here we go. Don't die out here, by the way. It's getting bright. You will love that song, It's Monetized. Please don't. <laughs> Please, I, what do you mean? I don't know what you mean by monetized? Or like it's able to... Do you mean it's not copyrighted? Because that's good. I would like that. Hurry up. Hurry up, Hobbs. Hobbs is just getting better and better, though. About to have 50 lockpicking. Machine cult up in here. I'm just... Ho okay, okay, okay. Skeleton repair kits, a guardless katana worth three grand. Don't mind if I do. Uh, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, no. Transfer some of these bolts into this part of the inventory because, oh no, wait, it won't stack here either because he doesn't have the right kind of backpack. Um, those skeleton repair kits are worth so much. Uh, we need to get Squabblin back in here. Squabblin trade with Ruka. Yeah, empty this out. I don't need this fucking metal. Fuck that. <laughs> Just one at a time, get it all out. Okay, now. Squabblin Jr., come over here, pick up the shit that we can stack. Why did you walk right past the spider? I mean, it worked, but... Okay, there we go. Each one of these is $4,000. I don't know if I can make that... If, if I can say that more clearly and make and, and really drive home how much fucking money we are making. This right here is over $40,000. We have never even seen that much money. That is, an, that is an insane amount of money. Okay, Hobbs, continue. Uh, we're going to try upstairs now. What is this? Nothing. Nothing too bad. Okay, nothing. I mean, nothing worth. Secure weapon cap. Ooh, oh, oh, get away, get away, get away. Nope, don't be caught. Okay, Hops. Hops, you're a stealth master. Get over there. Ah! A jite. Ooh. <laughs> Manufactured by Edgewalker. The Edgewalkers were a group of smiths of the old fallen empire hundreds of years ago. That's what I was fucking looking for. Ancient weapons. Little is known about them except that their weapons have survived these hundreds of years in near perfect condition. And their quality is unrivaled by anything crafted in the modern age. It's a blunt weapon that does 1.26 with a defense bonus of plus 8. Not bad. It is designed for non-lethal takedowns though. So, maybe not perfect for me going and killing people, but maybe for, like, 
kidnapping or something. Don't, don't, don't do that. Don't, no, 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 go, go sneak again. No, 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 don't be caught. Stop it. There you go. You're good. There you go. Just stay away. No, <laughs> no. Don't worry. If he can't get to you, he can't kill you. Hobbs, sneak away, please. I can't die here. I don't know how strong this thing is, but it's probably stronger than us. And it probably, it looks like it has like a fucking machine gun on it. Oh, wait, those are just hands. Is there anything else worthwhile in here? Hobbs, stop! What is in here? Nothing. Okay, I need to get into these chests. Ooh, sleeveless dust coat. Worn by the weirdos out of the Ashlands. Very good dust coat, and it's worth uh, 4,000 bucks. Nice. What's in here? Weapon cabinet. There we go. There we go. Get it. A ninja blade manufactured by skeleton smiths. 2,000 bucks. Very nice. Um, I'm gonna... Mm, I need to, like, get this skeleton out of here or something. I need to- I, I need to leave real quick and sneak back in. I think it's what needs to happen. Some- somebody pick up carp real quick. Hobbs, you just run in- no, well, uh... Okay, Ruka, pick- pick him up. And now run away. And now Hobbs run around this way. And then- Whoa, no! No! Now squabbling, just go up there and take the shit. <laughs> uh, run past. Nice, nice. In the days of 76, when and young and old nice, <laughs> nice music. The Edge Masters, also known as for their sonic OCs. I've always wanted to be an Edge Master myself. Pick that lock. Squabbling Jr. is actually good enough. I was afraid he might not be. Okay. As long as we don't run into any gorillos or anything, we can distract the spider for a little bit. Not a problem. Squirve got seen. Squ hey, guys. Guys, get behind the building. There you go. Squabble Jr., you finish? Okay, you're working on it. No, you're not. Work on it. There you go. Should be, should do it. Luckily, being faster than the enemy gives you quite a big advantage. Hops can just run in circles here and never have to engage with this thing. You do it? Nice. Uh, it wasn't anything. Okay. Um, now, you know what the, the interesting thing is? This would actually be a great little outpost if there wasn't that fucking guy in it. Like, that's really the only problem with this little place. More food. Fucking nice. We're never gonna have to eat again. Or, I mean, never gonna have to get food to eat again. Like, these little beds. Lots of storage. Skins? Skins. Empty, though. Uh... Nice! Oh, what's that? Weapon display. Oh, yeah. Basically, we just became fucking millionaires from this one little outpost that we came across randomly and with only guarded by one spider who can't do shit. Longsword. Oh. Skeleton smiths worth a bunch. Yes. Now let's get the fuck out of here. Uh. Remix of Africa. I like it. I like it a lot. All of you, get out of here. You can, uh, stop sneaking. Why are you walking so slow? Is it because Squirve is, uh... Somebody pick up Squirve. Squabbling Jr. pick up Squirve. He's so slow that it'll be faster just to pick him up. Wait, we can splint injuries now! Yes! Yes! Splint your injuries! We've reached a new age of medicine! Uh... Go splint his injuries. Hobbs, don't fight. You're actually winning? Really? <laughs> no, don't. Don't do that. 
Don't do that. I don't. That was. You actually did damage, and he didn't hit you. I'm. Wow. Okay. All right. That's impressive, actually. But first, squabbling, splint, squirt. Can you not? Okay. Just pick him up then. I guess it's. There you go. Yeah. Now you're much faster. Uh. Oh. Oh no. No, don't. No, don't do that. Oh, hide. Okay, well, they're safe, but Hobbs... Oh, Hobbs. Go in here and close the door. Maybe that'll work. Can you close that door? Close the door. Hey, they're leaving. <laughs> hey, they killed the spider for me. Sweet. Okay, well, easy. Now we could just keep this base for ourselves if we wanted to. Uh, but I don't think we want to. I'll make sure I didn't miss anything. Eh, just metal and stuff. Not really worth it. Compared to everything else we have. We can just fucking buy building supplies and shit like that now. We have so much money. Skeleton muscle. Nice. Alright, that's another 2,000 bucks right there. Okay. Now. Let's look at all of our guys. Uh, you know, you might want to sneak, actually, just in general. But come over here. You guys are really fucking slow. You know that? I guess it could be worse. Uh, and we're gonna see, out of all the stuff we got, if there's anything better than what we have. So currently, we've got this Nodachi, which does 1.58. Manufactured by Skeleton Smiths. Pretty fucking good. But then we've also got a Longsword. Which does 1.5 altogether, with less blood loss. Less of a... Oh, it's got an attack negative, but a defense bonus. No, I'm not really feeling that one. Uh, what else we got? He's got a 1.48. This is a 1.38. That's all right. 0.98. 1.26. With a big defense bonus. 1.06. Not anything super good. 2844.60. That's way better than what you have. Put that on. Nice. Hand this over to Ruka. No room. Well. Uh, 16, 26, 50. 11, 7. Nope, that's not better. Uh, just keep that on you for now. Let's take a look at what Ruka has equipped. Point or 1.48. So that's the same as uh, Squabbling, so that's definitely better. Falling Sun. Fucking amazing, but really big weapon. He can keep using that. And squirve has got that. So actually, yeah, none of these weapons seem to be better than what we have, except maybe the blunt one, just because of that huge defense bonus and it still has good damage, and an indoor bonus. It's not bad. Uh, other than that, though, not really anything. Um, so happy we found that. That was f so fucking lucky. Uh, let's get out. Let's leave. So, with, that means that we can just sell most of this stuff and come out like bandits. Become extremely rich. Your group are gypsy no nomads. Why? Because we rob people? Acid. Are we melting in the acid? Why did we crawl through? Why did we decide that the quickest way through here was through the acid? Oh, it wasn't that bad. Ooh! Now you're putting up the fucking pumped up kicks remix. You get, you get some good shit this time. You guys know me. You know what I like? I just now, I'm working on that video, I mentioned it before, I'm working on this Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines video, I put in a school shooting joke just today. That's what I like, what can I say? School shootings are funny. It's part of my culture. As an American. <laughs> it's what we do. Our schools suck, so we shoot them. Uh, stop sneaking, run away. Be faster than them, please. You seem to be faster than them. Okay, good. Good. If we weren't faster, this would be extremely bad. But luckily, we are such fucking madmen. We are so bolt that we can run, we can outrun these land bats even while encumbered by, you know, a shit ton of loot. It doesn't even fucking matter. We still outrun them. We've been, we've been bulking up our legs for the past millennia. Ever since we started this game, millennia being in this case 30 days or so, we've been just bulking. Oh, we're getting down to this road here. Probably a good idea. I don't know if you actually run faster on the roads, but I think you might. Yeah, run for your lives. 
Uh, I'm gonna keep an eye out to see if there's any good shit around that we might wanna... Like, another outpost like that? We don't even have enough room. If we found another outpost, I would just have to mark it on the map and come back later so that we can become rich again. I'm gonna take a drink real quick. Ah! Okay. Yeah, just continuing along the road. That's nice. This one is still following. Oh, he just gave up. Perfect. Okay, we're basically scot-free now. Uh, so I'm gonna start sneaking again. Let's take a look at home base. They are starving to death. Okay, right. Booblin was working on that, right? Yes. Booblin, go to here. We also just have a ton of money in general, so we should be able to buy lots of food and stop the whole starving to death problem. The funniest thing about school shootings is it's always a spurg. A guy called Medicare does a good job talking about it. Yeah, I've watched some Medicare videos. I don't watch all of them like I used to. Back when he was, uh, you know, went by different names. He's still stuck in that fucking corner. But, uh, I do watch his stuff occasionally. That shit about, uh, Hampshire. Pretty good. No armor. And it has a long sword. Weird. When did he get a long Okay. Um, I want you to buy all of that. And maybe most of this, too. Just so I don't have to keep fucking getting food. That's a lot of fucking money we just spent. That's fine, because we're about to be rich. And this is an investment. Stop it. <laughs> Stop with the northern version of that song. That's insulting to my culture. What is this? Minecraft parody. Uh, you know, you know, uh, mm. <laughs> Music is too loud or you're too quiet. Probably the music is too loud. But that's a nice problem to have. Normally I have the problem where it's too quiet and I can never fix it. So, thank you. Thanks for telling me. It should be good now, I think. It might be a little quiet now, but I think it might be good. Who the fuck can see me? Who? Over here, where we're going? More rats. Okay, well, if you get spotted, you got spotted. Just run for your lives. Just run. Crumbling labs. Now, wait a minute. Oh, that looks like the kind of place you'd find some good shit. And it's called labs. There's, like, ancient technology in there. There's fucking mind-melding shit. VR. That's, that's where the, that's... I want in there, but I have... It's... You gotta swim through acid to get there, first of all. Not much acid. But then I don't, even, I don't even have room. What am I gonna do when I get in there and find some, like, fucking Tesla laser or, like, energy weapon or something? Directed energy weather weapons. I can't use that shit because I can't even pick it up. So we're out. We gotta run. We gotta leave. But we... It's marked on our map, which is very nice. We know exactly where it is. Wait, that is it, right? Yes. Yeah. We know where it is. We can come back later, pick up the good shit, harvest the technology to purge the Xeno scum. I mean, we should, but unfortunately, what are the Xeno? These fucks? <laughs> Ruka? That kind of Xeno? Or what? We'll have to, uh, no, gorillas. No, just get it. Just pass by. Okay. Okay, good. Good. We're out. Um, we'll come back here. Is that another thing? Or is that the same place? That's the same place. What the fuck is that? Leviathan. Yeah, it's pretty big. Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty big. I guess Leviathan's a good name. Uh, luckily we're not going that way. We're going this way. So just ignore that fucking thing. Big boss monster. Oh, how strong are you? Seemingly pretty strong. You can't dodge, though, fat fuck. Uh, yeah. We'll just ignore him. Or we'll head right towards him, because that's where we're going. Where, is that really the best way, you think? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, just sneak around, please. Don't get caught by that guy. I don't really... I mean, like, compare the sizes here. Who's, who sees us? Who? 
The Leviathan? No. Someone behind us. Okay, run. Run for your lives. You should try and tame it. Uh, you know, I mean... I think I'm just gonna pass it by. I, we can hardly even beat up fucking vagrants. Which is what I'm gonna go try and do. I'm gonna go beat up some vagrants, so now we know whether or not we can do that. But please don't tell me gorillas are fast. Please don't tell me gorillas are fast! 14 miles per hour. Okay, we are going uh, 10 because of encumbrance. What are you going? 18, okay. 14, okay. So it's just Squabblin. Squabblin needs to get lighter. Ruka has, or no wait, Hobbs. Okay, so what we do is we take some of this really heavy stuff and we give it to Hobbs. Um, 141. Yeah, all right. Hobbs, I need to unload. These all only weigh one thing, though. Drop these fucking books. What is this? Hall and Oates Man Eater remix? Okay. That thing is moving with a vengeance. I know this thing is fucking chasing me. It's running me down like crazy. What are its stats like? It will fucking eat me. I am sure of it. Okay. Uh. Oh, this stuff weighs so much. Hops. There's, he's got no room! No, no, wait. No, yeah, he's got no room. Um... Uh, <laughs> Ooh, this is good. Uh, this is- Ah, Hobbs! No! <laughs> Don't do that! Get the fuck out of there, Hobbs! Okay! This is where we stand and fight, I guess! Oh, we're gonna die. He's gonna eat us. Do these things eat people? They don't eat people, right? Please, I hope they don't eat people. Is Carp okay? These guys are both okay. Okay, put them down. Start fighting. Hobbs. We've got good weapons. We've got good armor. We just don't have any skills. Can our armor carry us? Carp, attack. Ruka, attack. We need to get on each side of him. I've, I've read a little bit about how combat works, and there is some depth to it. Nice, nice. Slicing them up. Not doing much damage. Getting hurt a lot. Slice them up. Squabbling, don't just stand there. Squirve, back up and start shooting. Okay, you don't need to back up that far. You're too slow. Nice! 58, okay. He's lost a lot of blood already. We're getting him. Gang up on him. We've got him. This is the fucking test of everything we've got. It's now or never. We are destroying him. Come on, he's fucking destroying us too, though. Watch the fuck out. Get him. Get him. Look at that damage. Look at that. Yes. Yes, get him. Oh, it's going to be close. Oh, it's going to be close. He does so much to us. We. I think we can actually do this. Oh, all of our stealing, all of our robbery is paying off. We've got the best gear. Cut his fucking head off. Yes! I can't believe it. All he gives us is regular ass animal skin? What a <laughs> Great. <laughs> this song is fitting for some reason. Yeah, that was fucking great. We actually did it. If another one comes, we're dead. But we actually killed... Not only did we kill an actual enemy who comes after us, we killed a fucking gorilla. These things should be really hard. We're fucking great. We're better than I thought. And even Squerve. Like, he sucks. He has no skills. But he, his his turret was... Or his eagle's cross was doing a lot of fucking damage just because it's so good. Uh, everybody... Hobbs needs to heal everybody. Quickly, too. Because, uh... Somebody's gonna come and we're gonna die. I, I can feel it. Okay, we're a little fucked up. Definitely don't want to get in another fight. Squirb didn't even get injured. Cool. Alright. We're probably all really slow still. Yeah, because of, uh... Why is Squabblin Jr. not following orders? We're supposed to, yeah, walk at the same speed. Okay, so the slowest guy has to be Squirb, right? By a lot. Okay, so who's the fastest? 12, 15, 21. You pick up Squirb. 
Okay. There we go. That's pretty fast. Okay, get the fuck out of this area. 